course as you can see the gatehouse nothing to nothing to actually repair have a full army in there we can get some katana samurai here which we might do because they have a sword school my army is well placed here with another unit on the way we can ambush them perhaps if they come this way which they may do they're going to be a little bit weaker now that they have no um they have one less settlement we've started to take control of this island this unit of cav can now meet up at sanuki as well tosa's fairly well defended i think yo we'll have to recruit a few units in the next few turns once i get a bit more money just double check everything see enemies so masayo Chosukabe can you can can't even say it Chosukabe Masayo has a son Chosukabe Kaniori that's good and my daimyo Chosukabe Kunichika has another son Chosukabe Motosura I could make him my heir however Chosukabe Motochika is the heir Historically, Moto Chosokabe Motochika actually unified all of Shikoku in about a 10-year period, but unfortunately he lost it. He lost Io, Sanuki, and Awa, and was left with Tosa. And he was made a vassal. Okay, I think we can end turn there. We banked up, we know that. Um, my knowledge of Japanese history is quite limited what I've learned is from Shogun 2 and from reading up on things on Wikipedia Google and some articles and stuff that's one thing I like with Total War though they get you interested in periods of history which you wouldn't necessarily be that interested in perhaps which is quite good okay Tosa oh Tosa's quite unhappy now that's a shame I can't really afford to exempt you so I'm just gonna Oh, I can't recruit nothing either. Shit. Light calf can get the Tosa though. They do need some light calf, so we'll just stick them in there. And Eo is unhappy as well. <laughs> and they're on minus one also. It's not the end of the world if we get rebellions. We can probably crush them as long as we manage it properly. We actually found the Urukami now as well. They're indifferent. Their allies with Beso and their enemies are Amako and Kikawa. Alliance, maybe. Can't trade, unfortunately, so we've got nothing to bargain with. It's important that I get a trade port as quickly as I can. I have a harbour. It costs me 1,800, so I need to get these as quickly as I can so I can get more money. Once I do that, I should be okay. I'm going to wait a few turns to recruit units. I can't recruit units, but I can get the replenishment going. Tax rate is on normal. Let's see if I, I could go low, but I lose out there on the money. I could go up very high and get rebellions all over the place. Just going to keep it on normal for now. We might go very high the next turn or maybe the turn after. Uh, Mastery of Arts, two turns, that's good. Um, need to find out where they are, really, don't we? Don't want to throw a unit away either. Um, just gonna end turn because if I sit in Sanuki for a turn or two, it's easy to defend. Siege battles give a big advantage to the defenders in this game, so it's worth staying there if at all possible. Mission issued. Thirst for battle. Our men go restless, my lord, we're at war, our enemies make no attempt to invade our territory, yet we make no move to strike theirs. Plus two to melee attack for all units, if I defeat any army in battle. Mm, that could be interesting. Uh, plus one there. Now I see they're fine there now as well. I do agree, we do need to fight them. I'm just going to march into their territory. Just there. Hide. Can't see any of them there. Happy to hide there. Right, let's get the whole army. Whoops. Wrong button. Push them out. And they would be unhappy. I could exempt if I lose out on the money. Put my daimyo back in. Not my daimyo, my general. 
Ease replenish anyway. It's kind of dangerous doing this, but I gotta be offensive. I'm just gonna push out slightly while hiding, of course, just to see if I could see anything there. We'll farm up any units that we can then, but of course we can't afford anything at the moment. So we're gonna have to engage them, probably at a numerical disadvantage. Is there anything I can get with Yurikami? They don't want an alliance. That today ends well. Now speak of your wishes and intentions. Hmm. If you join my war, I will join yours. Nope. Not gonna get nothing with them, unfortunately. Urukami are in a good position. I am not at the moment. I think we can do alright with the the armies that we have. A little bit slow on the infantry, a little bit low, but I think we'd be okay. Blend turn again. Yes, we're bankrupt, we don't care. We're the Chosokabe, we don't care about money. Ah, there's an army then, but they moved. I think they're lining up for an ambush. Which could work in my favour because... I'll tell you why now. They moved by here somewhere, which means they're not at Awa. I think. See, they've discovered my army, so they're obviously around here. If I move this guy forward, I could get ambushed here. That's why I can't see them. That's good, because it means they might be lowly defended in Awa. I'll ponder that thought for a moment, but first, Amako. Can we get anything with you? Nope. Can't do anything until I get trade, so I'm going to be a bit cautious. Push out. I think we're okay to go. Oh, okay. We can take Awa, I think. They don't have any reinforced army by the looks of things. Yes, we can get it this turn. Yes, I think we've got enough to deal with it. And yes, my general can actually attack them by joining up. That's exactly what we're going to do. Sanuki's quite happy now without the general in there. And we're going to attack Awa. As expected. So we're going to continue the siege for a moment. They have one unit of bow, that's all they've got to watch out for. Excellent. This is perfect. So they, they, their main army is here. If I take Awa quickly, they'll be sandwiched between two armies and I can crush them here. Excellent. Right. Let's fight this battle, guys. I shall see you all on the battlefield. Hello, guys, and welcome to the battlefield. So a little bit trickier this time. They have archery towers, which I'm going to have to be wary of. Now looking at this... One tower's that side, one's that side. So we need to approach from here with my archers, my bows, but my general, and let me see. If I get a unit of cav over here with the bows, and my best unit of Yari Ashigaru, and then everything else which is over here, it's going to be grouped into one group. And it's going to actually face this way. Doing this for a reason that the bow tend to face the general. So I click start. And we're going to come forward with all of these. And I can't see them at the moment. They have one bow unit, I think I counted. But they also got the two towers, which you're going to have to watch out for as well. Right, these bow units are going to come forward to here. The reason why I've got these two is in case they do happen to charge me, I can fall back and hit them with a cavalry charge and a Yari wall if possible. I'm hoping that the bow units doesn't... Ah, right, excellent. The bow unit's actually up there. On the front, like I, I expected. Allows me to get some shots in on them. Whittle them down and then strike them. Can actually come forward a bit. Up here, perhaps. Give me a bit better line of sight. So they have light cav. Uh, yari, yari, lots of yaris, samurai. Bows on the front, but they. But we can hit all these units at the back. Their general unit is. Where is he? It's the light cav. Light cav is the general unit. 
Okay, excellent. Let's proceed. Let's bring the bows forward. About there. Gonna make a group, group three for these. Place them just behind. Try not to get the bows to come off the wall. Keep them there until we whittle them down. Because we could, we could probably charge up the walls or burn the gates and charge in. And we might get a victory that way. However, we would lose an awful lot of men. And knowing that they have a large stack hidden in the forest somewhere, it's wise not to go uh, and do that, provoke the attack. Oh, what's happened? They're moving their bows. Where are they putting their bows? Oh, please don't put them here. It's the last thing I want. I think they are as well. Shit. Let's try and come forward a bit more. But there, maybe. Don't think we'll be in range there. What's happening? What are they doing? Ah, oh, no, they are as well. You bastards. <laughs> I was looking forward to an easy battle. <laughs> Bring them all forward like so. See, the problem is their bows can continuously fire upon me, and they will. We wouldn't kill as many as them as they'd kill of me. They have the height advantage, plus they have the protection of the walls. Ah. Although saying that, still possible. Send this unit to the front. We can still hit them from behind and get all these at the front. Towers are at the back anyway, so we wouldn't be in the way at the front by here. I might actually send two units here. Or would one be, be enough? One might be enough, so we might uh, keep it like that. Spread our line a little bit, just in case they attack. Make it a bit more flexible. We actually could get a shot on the light cab right now, I think. Bring this unit up to four ranks. This unit can go there, I think. Oh, this unit can go forward as well. Just going to fast forward a little bit. Ah, oh, we're nearly in position. They're not going through there, that's okay. We can actually hit their bows from where we're positioned currently. Anything which comes in this radius, we basically wipe out. We need to go a little bit further forward. We are winded, which isn't good. Let's give it a few moments. Get a bit of our stamina back. Don't want to lose this unit, of course. Bring them forward. I think this unit can come here as well. Just piecing everything into place quickly and efficiently. Little baby steps forward, just to get them into range. Fire arrows, see who they go for. They're going for the bow Ashigaru on the walls. Excellent, look at that. Got kills. Haven't reacted, so we can get some more free shots on them. We've also got the samurai retainers, which we can get shots on as well. This is good. Taking their bows out is good for us. We're going to bring our cav forward as well in case they attack they may come down here and attack us so we're gonna have to be wary light cav samurai retainers 113 out of 60 excellent it's going well bow unit is going to come and join up with them like so Bring them forward also. Camera, uh, cavalry in position. Yari Ashigaru in a position as well. 
I'm putting them in, the, in by here because there's two entrances which they could come and attack me from if they come out. Of course, the more of these we kill, the better. Less bows to fire upon me. Excellent work. And we we'll hit the flaming arrows for them. They can now fire upon them as well. Excellent, here we go. Not as many that time. Unfortunately, a lot of them are in the buildings. Not going to be able to hit them, I don't think. Uh, we can't actually fire from there, so we're just going to hold our position in. And it looks like they're bringing some men forward and repositioning. Keep this unit here, because that's who they're facing at the moment. And they're like calves getting obliterated by the fire arrows. Oh man, this is good. This is good, my friends. 41 remaining. Oh. Death. Death, death, death. Lots of Yari Ashigaru, which I'm a little bit concerned about because... Yari Ashigaru on the high ground in a settlement are quite dangerous. Down to 11. Excellent. Finally, this unit can come forward. He's going to come here as well. And we'll just kill anything which comes into this radius. Yari Ashigaru. When we do climb, I think it'll be from this wall because it's the thinnest wall. Less casualties on a lower wall than a high wall like that. You can lose, say, 10 to 15 men here, where you could lose about 30 or 40 on this one. Always worth considering when trying to climb. They are down to 117. And now this unit can also join in. Nope, not this one. Wrong one. This one can also join in from there. Their bows may actually come off the wall now that I've moved that unit. We'll see what they do. In a way, I hope they do because we can get some shots on them while they move. We're only taking a few of them down like this at the moment. Gonna line up like that, I think. That'll be better. Reposition now. Uh, we've taken out uh, one third of the unit, so that's good. Bring these forward a bit. Not going to commit these until the very last moment. And the light cab is virtually gone, and now, of course, aim for the bow straight away. Again, them all three to aim for the bows because they're off the wall and they move in. Excellent. Lots and lots of death. Woohoo! Down to half a unit. Just like that. And those bows are not going to cause me a problem now. And we're going to get some kills on the Yari Ashigaru here as well. Right. Pull back because their bows are now taking position on the wall and we don't want to be in range. Our bow unit is going to come this side instead. Minimise the losses. As you can see they're firing. I think we've taken a few hits. A couple of losses here and there. Nothing to be too concerned about, I don't think. Yep, we're losing a few men. Two of the bows. Get them into position this side. Get some kills. About there. Just looking at what they have. 194. 200. 200. 200. 71. And of course their general is dead. 
the cavalry. So they're going to have that morale shock anyway. Come forward a bit. Get some shots on the Yari Ashigaru. But they... If we can weaken all the Yari Ashigaru units, this will be a pretty quick battle, I think. Excellent, they're all in range. Watch the fireworks, guys. Watch the fireworks. Or well, not quite. For some reason, they haven't done it yet. Now I'll click. Bow's not facing me, they're facing over there. Oh, they've pulled off, damn it. See the bows, their range won't be quite there. You'll come off where the cursor is about there, that's where the line of sight would be. So I'm not in the line of sight by here. And we are getting some shots away. On the Yari Ashigaru. Excellent. Well, they do have the light cab remaining, but only two units, nothing to be scared of. And there is their general. Excellent. Yali Mejing. Get them up there. All of these are going to go there. And then there. Like so. Oh, Mario! More arrows being fired. Over the wall. Straight into their face. A few kills here and there. 95, 195. Yari Ashigaru behind them. Hello. Use fire when possible. Two of these units have fire. Woohoo. 123. More arrows come in. Wasn't a good volley. Now they're moving, it won't be. Oh, got the other unit, but there, that's good. Get as many shots as possible. I'm gonna reposition, get everybody firing, not just the front rank, but the, all the ranks fire, get more use out of my bow units, path forward, in position, and fire. The reason I'm doing this like this is because i got to account for the men that I'm going to lose on the wall when I do eventually climb. My men are almost in position as well. All my Yaris, my Cav, all at the front now. That's where we're going to climb up here and here, these two points, either side of the gate. Use up everything that we have. One of our units has used all its ammunition, my lord. One of our units is out. That's you. That's fine. You're going to come back. More kills on the Yari Ashigaru, down to 130, ooh, 133, that's a good volley, a very good volley then. And this unit's out as well, so we're going to pull them back also. They'll be reinforcing. We should have about 50% of our ammo with this uh, unit, so we're going to use it all up. 115, that's not a bad volley. So they have a full unit here, I think, and the Samurai Retainers, I think that's it. Oh, and this one, this unit of Yari, Ashigaru, and Garrison. Now might be the good time to launch the attack. So without further ado, two units are going to go there. Two units are going to go here. General is going to be 
right up against the wall. Reason being, arrows can't fire at me from that position, I don't think. Well, actually, won't go yet. We're going to pull back. And I'll, they'll be in my uh, radius to actually um, inspire and so forth. And the light cav's got to be gone after that, surely. Yep, light cav is gone. The general's now dead, surely. Excellent work. Get the Ari Ashigaru to come up from this side. Get the light cav a bit closer here. This unit is still firing, still doing volleys for me. On the garrison. 147, that's good, good volley. They're gonna keep losing men to my bows while I fire. 138, that's good. One of our units has used all its ammunition, my lord. He's now out, he's gonna climb for us. My bow units are all going to be used as infantry now. Use the extra men where possible. Yari Mejin. Let's get them up here quickly. They're going to be engaging now the units on the wall, the bow Ashigaru. But there's only 69 of them. Should be fairly formidable. And now it's time to bring the cav right up against the wall. Of course they are weakened and plus their general's dead so it should have a good effect for us. Help them rout quicker. Boashigaru is fighting to the death. Let's get my bow samurai in there. My Yari samurai sorry. Yari Meijing. And then kill. Get my general to. Ooh, pathfinding. Pathfinding is terrible over there. If only we could get this capture point by here and get the all the cavalry in, that would be nice. Rapid advance. Shake them up. Yari Ashigaru wavering the garrison against the bow. Units, funnily enough. But I have Yari Ashigaru there as well. Pushing them back. Down to 23, down to 76. Oh no, don't rout. Don't rout. No. Right, time for the general to. Uh, where's it gone? Rally. Hopefully at the right time I've rallied. Oh, sieges are so tedious. Click like mad. You probably hear me click in. Once I get past this part, I can just get that capture point, get the cavalry in straight away. Our men are running from the battlefield. Oh. A shameful display. We've lost quite a lot of men doing this. This is dangerous, really dangerous. 60 and 50 against 89. Oh man, it's going to be close. Down to 20. Oh my goodness, it's going to be close. We're actually the favourites according to the balance of power, but I don't quite see it that way. Most of their men are fighting to the death. Our men are running from the battlefield. Shameful display. Shameful display. They are Ashgaru are confident. Oh man. Oh, what are you doing? You fool. What the hell's my general doing? He just got into a big snake formation. Right, get the bows on this quickly. take that then we can get our general in our cavalry we've only got a few units remaining right now they can come in excellent 
Oh, where are you going? Not you. You keep killing for me. No! Shit. Oh, I misclicked and it may have cost me. We're gonna go for the big. No, we're gonna go for the retainers. Charge the retainers. And we're gonna charge the Yari Ashigaru. So 18 of them with my general. Not the best of charges. Oh man, this is gonna be horrible. <laughs> This battle is in the balance, well and truly. Pull through and then we'll go for another charge. Second charge with the light calf while the general pulls away. General's gonna go for the Ari Ashgar this side, light calf's gonna go for that side. Ah oh, man. If only it could get into Yari Wall. Amazingly I can still do this. They got one unit of Yari Ashikara, which just won't break. Oh man. Five and four. Losing way too many horses for my liking as well. Oh man. Right, get this light cab going. Get the light cab going, please. Don't know if we can catch us with horse on horseback. No, he can't. I don't really want to disengage with my general either. Oh man. Light calf, pull out please. Go for the retainers. General's going to be dismounting. Take this. Reason being, we take this, we got something to fire with. These guys are not coming back, unfortunately. I've got to try and do this with two horse units. And my cavalry's being lost as we speak. Right, mount back on, please. And we're doing quite well. Oh, man. Balance of power is in our favour, but this is going to go right to the wire. Our men are running no. The battlefield. A shameful display. All that's left is my general. Shit. This is going to be awkward. Oh, excellent. I think I got a Yari coming back. Pull through. We've got units coming back. Excellent. Let's get my general up there. He can't get out. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. My general's stuck. Uh oh, I'm trapped. <laughs> this is going to be awkward. Get them all climbing again. Let's go for this one unit first. Try and defeat him. Worked. Excellent. <laughs> it's like walking on eggshells right now. Oh, they're slow as well. Just completely take in all these units for a walk. Need to get the rest of my men up on this wall quickly. I might have been better burning the gate. I think I'm better burning the gate actually. Burn the gates, please. Oh, I can't believe I can't get out here. <laughs> Just gonna walk around for ages like this. Time's on outside, fortunately. They're going to burn the gates for me. What do they have left? They have. 17 samurai retainers, one Yari Ashigaru and 50 Yari Ashigaru. Oh, they've got this tower firing as well. This is going to be awkward. Right, that's going to explode any minute now. Oh no, they've routed. What? Oh no. 
Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I can't even withdraw. Just withdraw by yourself, please. I'll do it. <laughs> oh, that's a shame. I thought I could have won that. I blew that up and they ran. What an idiot. Ah, oh, this war with Miyoshi is going to go on for quite a while, I think. That was our best chance of a quick victory against them. And we've blown it completely. Oh, because my general got trapped in the actual settlement. Ah, oh. We've still got a lot of our men remaining, which is always welcome. Can't quite get there this turn, though. They've only got one unit of Yari Ashigari remaining. The rest, of course, would be the garrison. And we can't go in there because we know that they're going to trap us there. But I'm going to end this episode here. I've been Dragonheart. Hope you've all enjoyed. Until next time, goodbye.